Hey there, this is Tim with Sexton Lawn and Landscape. Just wanted to uh, take a few minutes to address the four different uh, turf types that we have in the Mobile Bay and Gulf Coast area. Uh, we have uh, St. Augustine grass, uh, centipede grass, Bermuda, and several different varieties of zoysia grasses. Um, just wanted to, to take a moment and uh, address the fact that, that each of these types of grass respond to spring weather a little bit different and they grow at different rates. Uh, so just expectations for how they're going to respond to the warmer weather we've been having and, and as spring uh, kind of encroaches and, and winter starts to wane, you know, we're going to get temperature changes that will affect the rates of, uh, of grass growth. Um, a big factor in that is just soil temperature and so until we get really a lot of really warm weather that can affect that soil temperature, um, the Bermuda grasses and zoysia grasses uh, their growth rates are, are really kind of muted and, and slower where centipede and, and St. Augustine is, is going to grow faster earlier in the year. Uh, so it's pretty typical into the, the April and maybe even early May time frame for some uh, zoysia lawns and, and some Bermuda lawns to uh, retain some kind of brownish colors. You can see this, this uh, turf area behind me is a Aztec zoysia and it's, uh, it's got a pretty good bit of brown in it. It's, uh, uh, March the 6th so uh, still really early for us to expect it to be uh, really green and lush yet uh, but uh, a zoysia lawn and a Bermuda lawn both would, would both uh, have a lot of uh, deep green color to it later on in the year so uh, it just takes it longer to, to it's got a different type root system it's a deep rooting grass and it just takes it longer for it to get enough warm temperatures to uh, to warm that soil up and, and tell the grass to start growing so uh, just want to make sure that uh, that everybody's got realistic expectations on on what they should see from their different turf types or different lawns that that are in their area. Um, if you have a Bermuda and a zoysia lawn, you just need to expect uh, to have a fully green lawn later on in the in the in the in the spring season. Uh, whereas if you have a St. Augustine lawn or, or a centipede lawn, you'll see it green up a lot faster. If you have any other questions or if there's anything we can do for you, you can reach us at uh, two five one. 626-3309 or uh, you can reach us online at www.sextonlandscapes.com or on social media with Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.